All right. Uh, good evening. This is Luke Thomas here, QuakePrediction.com, the Earthquake Channel. It is Tuesday, February 2nd at 7.25 in the evening. And we have a warning for California. We will probably update the other forecast uh, later on tonight, but we're going to just go with the, uh, the warning for California right now. And let's bring up the, uh, the graph here, the uh, forecast graph. And you can see we're going to go through uh, each of these days here. We've been forecasting a strong earthquake in Southern California for two weeks, starting at about the 16th or 17th of January. And uh, we finally figured out uh, how to forecast when. We, we get these large signals, and then it's usually within three days of that signal you have a quake. But some of the bigger ones, they hold off. And to know when they happen is the key to forecasting earthquakes, when and where. And we figured that out in the last uh, couple of days. So uh, we know the trigger and the location. So this is very important. We know the signals and then we know the trigger and we know the location. Now we know all three. So we're gonna review some of these quakes on this, uh, this uh, I call it the trigger graph. These are the triggers and the peaks and uh, when those quakes happen. First of all, the 3.5 that happened on the 20th in the morning in Los Angeles, Willowbrook, California, which in Los Angeles Basin on the 20th. That was uh, this quake right here. You see it right here in uh, just south of uh, Los Angeles in Willowbrook, Willowbrook on the 20th, January 20th. And these are Z times, so that's eight hours earlier than that, so about 8.30 in the morning. Then on uh, a 3.1 hit on the 23rd on this peak, and uh, this remember this data is for all of California, and we know how to find out the uh, location as well now. And that was on the uh, 23rd. And you can see that quake right here. That was a 3.1. And this uh, stronger peak here on the 27th was a 4.6 near Ferndale in Northwest California. And that was this one right here. You can see uh, 4.6 on the 27th. And that also was uh, in the morning, 8 to 25 in the morning on the 27th, which is this peak right here. And then on the uh, 30th into the 31st, we had a couple quakes. We had this one right here, which was at about 1 in the morning on the 31st. It was a 3.3. And then we were been talking about the risk now building in the south. This uh, 3.5 here hit down uh, near the Salton Sea. And that hit on uh, 4Z on the first. So it was actually uh, about uh, 8 p.m. in the evening on January 31st, which is right there in that peak, 3.5. Now this, you can see here on the, the end of the third, the risk is rising rapidly. And it should peak on the 4th. I'm looking at extended data. And uh, right now, it's, it's rising rapidly. And uh, we're looking at maybe a peak on or a trigger on the 4th or the 5th. So our data is not totally complete yet. But uh, this is rising rapidly. Uh, the, the, uh, so we should have a, uh, and the forecast spot is in uh, Southern California, as you can see at some of these other videos that we have out, is uh, down near the Salton Sea. Here's also down near the Salton Sea. This one here is down in the Salton Sea. So tomorrow, tomorrow's forecast will be able to, uh, it'll be tomorrow will be the third, it'll be at the end here. We'll be able to give you a better idea of uh, the exact location. Right now we're thinking uh, near the Salton Sea and we're thinking sometime in the afternoon on the 4th when this quake will hit. Uh, but we're having, uh, we had a strong signal back on the, I think it was the 16th of the month, of January. And now we have these triggers. These triggers are the, what uh, finally triggered the quake. This 4.6 here on the 27th was a little stronger. And this 3.5 on the 31st, not only did it produce a 3.5, but it produced a swarm of earthquakes and I was kind of worried about this, that this would uh, trigger the quake. But now we're getting a much, much stronger uh, release here. And this is coming most likely on the 4th, February 4th, or the 5th. 
and uh, the fourth now seems like the day that it'll hit. So here's the uh, warning, major earthquake warning, 7.0 to 7.2 is earthquake is now likely February 4th or 5th. And I also added over on Twitter and Facebook that uh, the 4th is the more likely date, most likely near the Salton Sea. Now, as we get closer to this quake, it might end up being uh, northwest of Los Angeles, the highest risk, but we won't know that till most likely tomorrow, we'll be able to get a better idea of exactly where it's gonna hit. So uh, stay tuned, a uh, very strong earthquake coming to Southern California on most likely February 4th or 5th, even more likely on February 4th, most likely near the Salton Sea right now, but uh, future data looks like it might possibly be northwest of Los Angeles. We'll know better tomorrow in tomorrow's forecast, so stay tuned. Tomorrow evening, we'll put out another uh, video forecast and we'll give you an update on the situation. But please warn friends and family, this uh, uh, data signals and, uh, and uh, forecasts is based on 15 years of research. And uh, we finally have the all that we need to forecast earthquakes is now is, is going to be very easy from here on out. We have the signals and now we know the triggers and we know the location as well. So stay tuned, strong earthquake coming to Southern California, uh, most likely February 4th or 5th. Please warn friends and family uh, of this strong earthquake. Thank you so much. And we will talk to you tomorrow night and give you more updates on this quake. Thank you so much.